My name is Amy Edwards. I'm a pediatric infectious disease specialist at University Hospital's Rainbow Babies and Children's Hospital, and I'm the Associate Medical Director for Infection Control. And I am here to introduce you to the coronavirus. So the questions that I'm being asked a lot are, you know, what is this virus and what can we do to prevent it? This virus is a non-human coronavirus. So human coronavirus is a virus that circulates in our population all the time. This one is not human-based. It came from a different species and crossed over into humans. That's what makes it a little bit harder for us is because we don't have that innate immunity because it wasn't in our, um, in our population to begin with. However, there has not been widespread uh, uh, disease progression here in the United States. It is mostly located overseas. And I do want to remind you all that at this point, there is no confirmed case in the state of Ohio. The most important points that I think I would like to make at this point is one, there is nothing to panic about. Um, there have been cases in the United States, but again, it's not widespread. Um, the second point I'd like to make is that masks do not work for coronavirus. Uh, if you are a healthy individual, uh, wearing a surgical mask is not going to prevent you from getting it. Um, we do actually use masks like that on sick individuals to prevent them from spreading it to other people. Um, and the fancier masks, the N95s that you see people spending a lot of money on and buying, um, those kind of circular masks that fit on the front of your face, those have to be very carefully fitted by a professional in order for them to function properly. So I urge you not to waste your money um, because if it doesn't fit properly, it doesn't work at all. Um, the other question I get asked a lot is how to kill the virus. Um, your routine disinfectants that you have at home to keep your house clean will work for coronavirus just fine. This is just a normal respiratory virus. There's nothing special about it from a cleanliness standpoint. On that lines, regular hand washing with soap and water and use and or use of hand sanitizer will be just fine for preventing the spread of the virus. Um, as far as travel, the CDC is updating their website daily. So if you're planning on travel outside of the United States, just check there before you leave. For domestic travel at the current moment, I think that's fine as long as you take proper precautions on an airplane and wash your hands and that sort of thing. Um, and again, don't panic. We're all going to be okay.